We are going to begin with some breaking news. One of the Canadians who has been detained by China is now back home. The Canadian has been identified as Sarah McIver. Now, you may remember that she was the Alberta teacher who was being held by Chinese authorities. And at the time CBC News was reporting her story, China had said that she was working illegally in their country. At this stage, no other details are available, but we are trying to figure out ex exactly how this happened. Now, Ottawa, for its part has not confirmed that it is in fact Sarah McIver. However, this is the statement they have released, saying that Global Affairs can confirm that a Canadian citizen who was detained in China this month has been released and has now returned to Canada. They go on to say that due to the provisions under the Privacy Act, no further information can be disclosed. I want to give you folks a bit more context about this story as we continue to watch what is going on with this Canadian who's been released. Remember that that tensions have been growing between Ottawa and Beijing for several weeks now because initially there was the detention of two uh, Canadian citizens, Michael Spavor and Michael Kovrig, and many had seen this as an act of retaliation by China because Canada, at the request of the United States, had arrested a senior official or a senior executive with Huawei, this major Chinese telecommunications company. There was an arrest warrant in the United States under international law. They had requested that Canada arrest her when she was at the Vancouver airport on December 1st. Canadian authorities did that, abiding by the law, but it has been Canada that has received the brunt of aggression and perhaps retaliation from the Chinese authorities. After those two men were arrested, we started learning about Sarah McIver, and now it seems that she has been released. No update at this point about Michael Spavor or Michael Kovrig. We'll continue to watch this developing story for you as the day progresses.